this. Um, this is my story about myself. Uh, this most recent weekend that we just came off of, we uh, went up to my friend's land to celebrate a friend's birthday. And it's up by, you go up to Guthrie and you take the second exit to 105 and then just go east for like 17 miles. Then you're out in the sticks. And the guy's land, like the person who owns that land, he is the most carefree person ever, and he's like never on time to anything. So we got out there way before he did. <clears throat> and it was me, the guy who we were celebrating with, like it was his birthday party, and then a chick from my work. And we got there and we're like, well, we can't really do anything. We can't like go inside the house because it's locked. So we just started shooting stuff. Because he brought his pistol and I brought my AR and my pistol. And we just started tearing stuff up. So we're just hanging out. They finally, my buddy who owns the house finally gets there. And we start unloading all the food and crap into the house. And, <clears throat> And we just kind of piddle around for most of the night. We go out and shoot a little bit more. Um, anyway, so we get to dinner. Oh, reverse. We have these cookies, right? They're about that big, maybe. And my buddy is standing on the other side of the kitchen. And we're like, hey, toss that to me. And so he tosses it. And we're trying to see if we can catch it in their mouth, like, first. <laughs> I'm the one. I caught it first. So that was fun. Okay, fast forward. Um, the chick from my work, I ended up taking her back to Edmond because she had something to do. And then I drove back and was going to stay the night. So I had to pick up stuff from my house, stay the night. Well, I bring fireworks. I was like, man, this is going to be a great night. So I had a bunch of like bottle rockets and these things called Shazams that you light them and you're supposed to put them on the ground and they like spin around and then they shoot off in a direction that's unknown. But I always like to throw them and have a good time. And sometimes they feel like it hits you. Anyway, so I'm home, we're all out there like guys brought fireworks, we're having a good time. So we go outside, we're starting to light them off, like, ooh, that's fun. And I take a bottle rocket. And I'm holding it like this. I'm like, all right, man, waiting for this bottle rocket. And I like, don't want to burn my face. But I like look this way. I'm like, is this thing going to go? And as soon as I say that, the like backsplash or whatever you want to call it of the firework comes back, hits me in the face, and so my face is on fire. <laughs> I'm like, son bitch, I got to set this up. So I like start like trying to set my face out. And I'm like, bent over like this with the bottle rocket in my hand and for all of you who don't know bottle rockets pop at like whenever they shoot up you know and then they go bah well it goes bah right here and I'm like my ears are ringing it's unbelievably loud and I cussed a lot and then we all just kind of made fun of me for the rest of the evening about how stupid I was so and that's my story.